Now we're going to see the troubleshooting of the thermodynamic trap with a maintainable seat. There are two types of failures. One is open failure, the other is closed failure. To check the open failure, first one will check the installation of the trap. Ensure that the trap is installed in the right direction with the cap on the top side and the flow direction is being followed. Once that is checked, open the cap. Check for any kind of foreign particle deposition between the seat and the disc. If so, clean the same. If any fine scratches are observed on the disc or the seat, do the lapping procedure. Reassemble the top cover. Once it is assembled, check the discharge pattern. The second type of failure is closed failure, where the trap is not discharging at all. In that case, check for the drip leg before the trap, whether it is choked or blocked. If so, carry out the flushing activity. The second thing to be checked is the inbuilt strainer which is present inside the trap body. Dismantle the strainer cap. Clean the strainer screen with the help of wire brush and kerosene. Once this is done, reassemble the screen and check the trap performance. This is how one troubleshoots the thermodynamic trap.